So as you guys may already know by now, there was a pretty bad school shooting that took place in a small town called Parkland, Florida. And I know this is a very sensitive topic to talk about because young kids lost their lives this afternoon. And as I'm recording this video, 17 students are confirmed to be dead. And it really is just a big tragedy, a very, very sad day. And as a student myself, I really hate to say it, but with the recent news coming out so often of school shootings, I know I definitely have had the what if scenario of an active shooter walking into my classroom or the building I'm in or even at work like what am I gonna do if something like this happens because it very well could like could I do something to prevent it this kind of stuff is really scary and it's been happening more and more often especially this year and some things need to be done about this because these kids are just so young you know they've got their entire lives ahead of them and then it just gets cut short because of something so sinister like this it's just very 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 depressing and really sad to hear in the news like honestly this is all I've been hearing about lately just everything seems to be all sad and, dep and depressing in the news and I hardly ever hear anything good or uplifting about the country I don't know I just feel that we're all so divided right now it, it really does suck I, I just have this sad depressing feeling right now about this kind of stuff I've made videos on news like this before and every time someone loses their lives or a tragedy happens to someone I will not put ads on the video out of respect for them and their family and it applies to this video as well I, I think talking about this kind of stuff is the best thing to do because if we all don't address this then you know change is not gonna happen a part of me feels that maybe people who have contemplated you know committing mass murder maybe might change their minds if they see this tragedy and the terror is in the news uh, you know because it, it causes their families friends and just everyone across the world to be heartbroken and it, it's such a sad day because today is Valentine's Day you know and uh, for something like this to happen it, it really is depressing I'm not sure if this kid who did the shooting because he was only 19 I'm not sure if he was bullied or anything like this but uh, I, I know he got expelled from this school but I promise you as someone who has finished high school and is in college nothing that happens in high school will ever matter once you get to college I promise you I promise you none of it matters so if you're being bullied right now in school do not let it get to you talk to someone and let others know how you feel there are people out there who want to help you and be your friend and be someone to talk to heck if you're watching this and you're being bullied talk to me add me on PlayStation or Xbox or even send me a message or write me a comment because I will talk to you I want to be your friend you know talk to me let's get everything out because nobody should feel unsafe nobody should be getting hurt at school I take this stuff very very seriously but it really does amaze me how this teenager was able to get his hands on a assault rifle and apparently he would post pictures of weapons he had on his Instagram page and I don't know it just feels like this could have been prevented I think there needs to be more safety precautions at schools definitely there needs to be more drills done for sure uh, but yeah very sad day especially on Valentine's Day but uh, I hope you guys are having a great rest of the afternoon keep these people who are affected by this in your hearts or prayers let me know how you guys feel down in the comments and thank you for watching till next time I'll see you later